My name is Lizzie Hale, I'm from the band Hailstorm. I grew up in a 20 acre farm in Pennsylvania. I hardly have any color in my wardrobe at the moment. Because of my crazy little brother, I have patience for days. When I'm at home versus when I'm on tour, I definitely try to integrate a little bit of color, but I've gotten so used to being on tour, it's 90% of my time. Over the years, I've become kind of a minimalist, except for the shoe department, which is a whole other story. What I have to take into consideration when I'm on stage, especially now with every album cycle, I do something a little bit different. And for this album cycle, because of the way that we recorded it, basically erroring on the side of ourselves. I am wearing majority pants now. There's something that happens when I perform in pants versus a dress. Uh, you, you just approach an audience in a different way. I kind of like the uh, the toughness that comes with wearing pants and leather jackets or even Chuck Taylors, you know, it's like you just feel like all of a sudden you're punk rock and you can do anything. The majority of shoes that I own are, uh, are six inch heels. I only have a few sneakers and like today I'm wearing wedges. I've learned over the past, you know, many years being in the band um, how to navigate around a stage in heels and Originally, it was something that I started because it was one more thing that the guys couldn't do. <laughs> a lot of people like to take photos of me uh, navigating my guitar pedal board or, or my wah pedals with the heels. and I still think it's funny, so until I can't, I'm going to continue with the heels. <laughs> I find myself, um, I, I guess, a little bit of a tomboy when it comes to uh, my jewelry and especially the rings. Uh, with my rings, um, this is uh, a ring called Const Constantine, and I got this a couple of years ago. Really chunky, but like super awesome silver. And I like the idea of combining um, gold and silver. Maybe that's the way of integrating a little bit of color in my, in my life. The school ring is my newest one. This is, was really cheap. It was like nine bucks. So far, it hasn't rusted out my fingers. So, this ring I actually haven't taken off in uh, 12 years. This is gonna sound so cheesy, but the guys all, and I um, all have these rings. My brother slash drummer and I uh, decided we were going to get these rings made up. So we got four rings made up, even though we hadn't found our other members yet. Fast forward a couple of years later, we found Josh and Joe, my bass player and guitar player, and forgot about the rings. Found them in my parents' attic. And, uh, and decided to present them to them like, hey guys, here you go. And, and I know they, they probably won't fit because they were randomly sized. They fit both of their fingers on the right ring finger perfectly. Yeah.